Well, hi everybody, it's time for your Farm and Ranch News. Well, this week, the Montana Stock Growers Association, along with the Wyoming Stock Growers Association and Wyoming Department of Agriculture, hosted the 2013 Environmental Stewardship Tour in Northern Wyoming. And it turned out to be an amazing day on the ranch of this year's winner. We'll tell you who this year's winner is, and even show you some of the sights and sounds right after this. Putting money in the bank? Now that's a great feeling. Getting to the bank? That can be another story altogether. But with the new mobile banking app from First Interstate, we've brought the bank right to your fingertips. Our new mobile check deposit feature lets you put that check in the bank right now from wherever you are. Fast, simple, and secure. That's mobile check deposit from First Interstate Bank. Find out more at firstinterstate.com. Of course you know Tirerama is your best choice for tires, but I want to remind you that Tirerama is also your best choice for automotive maintenance and repairs across a four-state region. From oil changes to overhauls and everything in between, you can count on the pros at Tirerama to keep you going strong. Remember, at home or on the road, there's a Tirerama nearby to serve you. When we say Tirerama, more than just a tire store, we mean it. Tirerama, more than just a tire store. At the foothills of the Bighorn Mountains in northern Wyoming is where you'll find the headquarters of the Padlock Ranch. Now the 500,000 acre ranch operates in both Montana and Wyoming and is this year's Montana and Wyoming Stock Grower Association's Environmental Stewardship Award winner. The Padlock's president and CEO Wayne Fashold says winning the award for both states is quite an honor and encourages other ranches to apply regardless of their size. There's one of the things I want to point out that, you know, Padlock's a large ranch, and it could be easy to say, well, Padlock can do it, but we can't do it. There's nothing here that we're going to be talking about today that uh, we put a lot of money into. It was uh, partnerships with uh, government. Uh, NRCS, for example, did a lot of work here, and uh, so there's... Any producer could participate in these programs and do that. Tucker Hughes is the president of the Montana Stock Growers and says his organization is very proud of the Environmental Stewardship Award and to this year work with the Wyoming Stock Growers. This is the first time that we've ever worked with the state of Wyoming and had a combination of, of a ranch like the Padlock that straddles the borders and is in both states and they won the Leopold Award, what they call it in their, in their state in Wyoming and our Montana Stock Corps Award, so it's quite an honor, it's, it's quite a ranch, it's really something for us in the business to see and for a lot of other people to see too. For ranches like the Padlock Ranch, today's beef cattle industry is more than just turning grass into pounds of beef. It's about things like sustainability, it's about providing quality air and quality water, it's about providing habitat for wildlife, and it's about providing recreational opportunities for the general public. A lot of times when you talk about sustainability, uh, it's about a particular pet interest. And you might be just talking about uh, the river out here and, and fishing the river and so forth. But really, when we talk about sustainability, it's a big picture item. And it involves all areas of the ranch. Uh, we've got to be improving our ranges and, and maintaining them the way they are. Uh, basically, sustainability is talking about enduring. And when you look at that, it's economic and it's social and uh, environmental all wrapped into one. It all have to be there in order to be sustainable. Jim Wilson is the president of the Wyoming Stock Growers Association and says the word stewardship has special meaning. Stewardship is a, is a large word. It, uh, you know, it covers not just only cattle, but uh, conservation issues. Wildlife is a big, big part of that. Um, I think that that more ranchers in Wyoming are real stewards of the land than they realize. They just don't have the ability or want to showcase what they do best. And there is no question that the Montana and Wyoming's Padlock Ranch exemplifies what environmental stewardship is all about. That's a look at your Farm and Ranch News. Have a great day.